In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to build this board inside of Ireland. If you guys do enjoy this video, make sure you do subscribe and leave a like down below if you do enjoy it. And let's get right into it. So if you want to know how to actually get this sword on your back and actually start progressing inside of the Roblox battle, let me know down in the comments and I'll make a video on this. So if you want to build this, what you'll need, you can use any block, but I'm going to use stone as I built it over there. What you want to do, you want to get some stone and you also want to get some glass of your choice. So it's optional what kind of glass you want. I tend to use blue because it looks a lot nicer on this board and it kind of gives it that kind of tint look. So it definitely looks pretty cool. However, we're going to be rebuilding this and showing you how to build it because a lot of you have actually requested on how to build this. So what you want to do, you want to start off with a line and you want to build up on either side, leaving a gap in the middle like that. So on each layer, you want it to look like this. You can, you can kind of include it into your base wall if you're building it out of stone or out of wood. You can still use this setup. It looks pretty cool anyways. And then you just keep building up like this, like so I'm building across guys if you haven't joined the discord make sure you join it we are actually doing a purple flower giveaway so make sure you go check that out links down in the description so now what you want to do you want to build up on the side so you should have at least 12 squares on either side so one two three four five so that's ten what we need to do we need to add one more square on the side when you're done it should look something like this you might have to remove a couple squares you might have to add some so what you want to do now you actually want to place one block below ground level like this and you also want to build up by one as well like so so now that's taken place so this is where we will actually place the ground so you actually need to replace this with grass so let's place some grass down one two three four five one two three four five six okay so it should look something like this so this will be where we actually place the flower on obviously it's optional if you do want to actually have it or you can just place a block like this so what you could potentially do if you wanted to is get your block and place it like that if you wanted to or you can put it one back like this and place your block like that and then add a piece of flower right in front of it so you can pick this up and place it like that so it should look something like like that by the end result so we're going to be doing this and placing a piece of glass in front so thank you gaming for that now what we want to do is place one on either side like this obviously you can design it you can paint it gold you can actually do any kind of color you want with this however in this video i'll be using stone as it's easier for me to get so we're just going to build like this on either side all the way along so they won't actually see these blocks behind here they're just going to see the ones on the on the first block but if we place it like like this this covers it up and all we have to do now is place the blocks in so what we're going to do we're going to put it in a nice synchronized form but so what i tend to do is put dark colors at the top and then brighter colors at the bottom so light green will go here and then orange will go at the bottom here and then you kind of go in along this whole form like this so let's put that one there okay and then what we want to do we want to get let's say red and put it above orange and then with green, we want to put dark green above it like this. So you kind of get in that kind of pattern, the darker colors and the lighter colors. So dark green, then light green, red, and then orange. And you carry on on that process all the down. So let's make some cyan now. Okay, now we got some cyan. Let's go place this on our base just right here. So as you can see, dark blue and then light blue. So you're kind of keeping that flow all the way going down to the other side. And then let's say if say you don't have a block that you don't have yet, you can just place a block behind it and then just stick a sign saying still trying to get this it's entirely up to you what you want to do however what you want to do now is actually get the colors going let's place this one there because obviously it's red you want to place the correct flower with the correct block and then you want to get the dark green so green and then place the green one right here and then the lime green so if we type in lime type in lime like so and then place that there and then if we get orange, so now we can place the orange one. And we can also do this all the way down. So we do need to get this one. And then that, that. Basically continuing this all the way down. And then the white on the end right there. So you just keep on going all the way down. Obviously, the more blocks you have, the more 
you can complete this. However, if we come over here and look at this original one, you can see that I've actually labeled it on how to actually get it. So it's useful for you if you forget and it's also useful for those who come onto your base wanting to know or keep asking you how to actually get it. And now there's actually a board so you can actually just tell them or direct them to it so they know how to do it. So that is pretty good if you are interested in that. So this setup, obviously it can be changed, it can be adapted in any way you want and you can build it if you want as well. This version is really, really basic. So make sure you post it in the Discord in the creations area. If you actually built this, just take a picture of it and show me so I know that you guys actually like these kind of videos. Right, so if we wanna actually finish this up, all you wanna do is put some glass panes like this. It kind of brightens it up as well. You just do this on either side like this, all the way down and then you're pretty much done. However, we wanna actually make the plants more brighter in there. So you do actually wanna get some wall lamps or any kind of aquarium, glow in the dark lights or, or absolutely anything you want. I'll refer it back to my main setup, but I kind of have to take lights from here at the minute. And you basically just place it like this. So what this does, this pretty much brightens it up as you can see and it kind of glows a lot more in the dark so that is pretty good uh, and if we head over to this setup and jump up onto this all the way up and over you can see that we have like this aquarium block here I don't know how much they're worth I bought like two two for like 20k each uh, inside of a store and I'm not too sure how to actually get them but they break up the whole entire setup quite well and it glows in the dark pretty good so that is absolutely awesome so guys make sure you do join the discord if you are enjoying this video make sure you do like comment and subscribe if you are new before we actually end the video we do need to collect all of these so let's just go along and collect these so okay we got a pink okay let's pick that one up as well let's carry on heading down another pink black uh the normal ones here okay now let's go and water this oh i dropped my watering can let's pick this up and do this. so make sure you go check out how to actually get the orange fertile if you're not aware on how to actually get it make sure you go check that video that video out and or and in every single outro, I'll add one of your comments inside of the outro. Obviously, it's completely random who actually manages to get it. But at the end of the day, you guys get to be in the outro if you in the video. Wait, is that orange? That looks like orange. Uh, purple, blue, green. Oh, okay. I do need to complete these flowers over uh, these trees. So I do need to plant these. So if we head over here, we need to actually replant these trees. So let's get the avocado tree sapling and place it over here. So let's place. Okay, we just hit it. I thought we almost missed it then. Right, let's head all the way down here and jump across again. So let's jump, jump, jump. And then will we make it? No, we aren't. Okay, so we might have to wait for that tree to actually spawn before we can actually progress on back over to that island because we kind of completed this update. We're just waiting on the next one now. However, make sure you keep up to date because we're going to be covering all the new updates that have. So we'll be covering all the updates that have been dropping or going to be dropped inside of islands. So make sure you keep up to date. So apparently, there's something new in here. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, I don't think there is at all. Uh, by the looks of it, there isn't. But there should be something in there soon. But the event is coming very, very shortly. We're going to get like teleported to a arena or something via using either the key or the swords that's located in the main spawn. So make sure you keep up to date because I'll be covering how to actually get it inside of islands as soon as it drops. If you guys do want to know how to get the green sword, make sure you leave a comment saying how do you leave the do you get the green sword? Can you make a video on it in those exact words? And I'll make a video on it because obviously a lot of people do want this blade. And just a little insight, if you get the free blades, you'll be able to get a limited item that only the people who get the free blades actually manage to get. And if you're in the top 30, then you get a very rare item. So that being said, I'm going to leave this video here. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you do drop a like, subscribe and leave a comment down below. Thanks ever so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.